get into uh, the next part. I'm so excited. So let's uh, let's get back into it. Which one of these missions do we want to do? Um, I want to do that one. Investigate the safe room. Oh, I can just make jukebox tokens. Okay, we'll have to figure out what those are. Like, we know what they are. You put them into the jukebox and you go to a different place. But... I don't know why we would be getting multiple tokens. Well, that sounds neat. Containment. Sealed Threshold Hall. There wasn't even 10 New York minutes. My bad. <laughs> um, Where did it say I need to head? Sealed Threshold Hall. Okay.
This is the safe room Well showed me. The one with the altered item inside. More lore. <clears throat> Great. More clocks. Just because you have the if <laughs> the hits to deal with doesn't mean you aren't still on the clock. Thank you, Chaos. Damn it, I missed that one. Wait, no, I didn't. Uh -huh. Okay. Oh, that's not good. The fuck is that? Giant astral spike. Defeat the anchor. So I did damage to it when I shot its core while it was facing me. I failed to jump properly or fly properly <clears throat> off the side. So that's what killed me ultimately. It's my own my own stupidity. No, 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 because there was a checkpoint there. Have I not picked it up? There we go.
Holy shit. Okay. Okay. I have no idea why that fell apart right there at the end for the final thing. The clock wasn't there on the side that I was on. <clears throat> and then I kept having to deal with those other motherfuckers. Let's try that again. This time with Gusto. Mucho Gusto. side you open on first, right? It is. It's making more shots. I don't understand. me again. Oof. Oh man. I think I need to use the pistol because that charge up is uh, not helping me. Okay, so I can't hit it on its first one. It's a scripted event, I guess. Alright, the whatever number is a charm, right? Right? Right. And now, we know that the first one is a scripted event and I can't damage it. So I won't waste the clock.
Okay. Oh, that's not good. I have no clock over here to throw. Did I accidentally waste a clock? I must have, right? Also, how you doing, Lily? Yeah, I can levitate now. A lot of good that's doing me. Save for that. <clears throat> I 
So what did that get me? I don't think that did anything. Oh, that was an altered item, not an OOP. Okay. So I didn't get powers from it. I just had to contain it. Nope, that's not more. to do that. Still getting used to the fact that I can fly. promise I won't end up walking around covered in mold? Oh, the pill will prevent any biological infection by the mold. Take a mystery pill because a rude lady in a hazmat suit tells you to. <laughs> Great idea, Jesse. <clears throat> oh, honestly, did you want me to wrap it in cheese? Not the taste, the smell. It stinks in here now. Good. That means the pill is working. The worse it smells, the safer you'll be. Now go. Find the source. Thanks for the information. My pleasure. Significant research has shown the positive effects of talking to plants. I wonder if they talk back in ways we cannot hear.
Uh, no, Andy. Andy didn't intend on playing this weekend. Um, he's got the kids because next weekend he is coming to my place for D and D. Yeah. This is not where I want to be. I want to be over there. I reckon. Ooh, I've got an idea. Nice. Fuck yeah. You know, levitation has opened up so much freedom. I love it. Active threshold, but what am I meant to do here? This must be the pit Underhill was talking about. Should just be able to go down here now, right? Oh shit. Looks like Featherfall, yeah, it plays a bit like Featherfall too. It's real nice. Thank you, Mama Go, for that follow, by the way. I appreciate you. Ramsey, Ranger Captain, note 7.28, wait, uh, 6, 7, <laughs> Still in the fresh mold. I'll be straight up eating the vegetables now, because uh, why not? Mom said, eat your vegetables. Eat too many and your skin will turn green. Green like Ollie's. <laughs> hey, <laughs> Ollie. What'd you
Is that the source? It's... pretty. Oh. A lot going on. I have no idea how far down I got it. Um, before I get back in there, we're not going to use this. We're going to use this. Yeah, they are. <clears throat> They're the mods for the guns, yeah. Or the gun. Because it's one gun. Source? Was I not shielded? Oh, I must need to get on top of those. I think the whole area becomes bad, bad ground. Yeah. Rather than trying to do damage, let's learn the fight. Is that the source? It's kind of pretty. Okay, they're heat seeking. Don't 
why I brought up the map. Ow. This is rough. I just remembered that I have a shield. keep getting it to the same point it feels, regardless of how fast I get his health down.
Is that the sword? It's pretty. Yeah, it does a floor thing. Okay. Okay. Now I understand. We got this. Is that the source? It's kind of pretty. Nope. No. to get back up there. What is he doing? He is starting to believe. <laughs> and then I did it. Damn it, Chaos. Damn it, Chaos. <clears throat> was it that obvious I was in the zone that time? Well fought. Thanks, dude. I appreciate that. That felt good. Oh, good. Oh, need 
Mm. Oh no. I think I'm beginning to construct a pretty good layout in my head of this place. mold from your eyes. I take it that means my pill worked. Now tell me everything. Did you find the source? You did, didn't you? I found a big angry plant. Like <laughs> gigantic. I killed it. Feed you me, killed Seymour. it. You found the source and you killed it. I could have learned so much from a live specimen. Her concern is touching. Really. It's too much. Here. I brought you a sample. A piece of the innermost mold. You're not such a lost cause after all. Strange. So different, even superficially. Another stage of growth, perhaps. Please, no more stages. You'll be pleased to know that cutting down the creature at the source has already resulted in a notable cessation of the mold's rapid growth. You've bought me time for further study. So what now? Uh, there's are. places back while you were busy in the, pit, near the beginning that had mold that I couldn't get through. Beyond the threshold. I probably can now. They managed to sneak but out I don't remember where the they were. Noticing. There's a reason I didn't send Steve and Andy to find <clears> the mold source with the others. These vagrant hosts must be eradicated as soon as possible. The mold can still be spread by their overgrown bodies. Any idea where they went? The hosts I've observed are not a sprightly bunch. Here are the reports I've received. They'll help you find them. I'll go take care of them. Good. Maybe this will take me it. to those areas. There's a nice That would be good game that. design. Have you worked with Emily Pope? Our paths have crossed. Darling arranged for us to have a coffee. A meeting of the minds, he called it. She's talented. I can certainly see her doing well here. I feel like there's a butt coming. But she's drunk a bit too much of the Bureau's proverbial Kool-Aid. She shouldn't be afraid to forge ahead on her own. Science is skepticism. Everything must be questioned before the truth can emerge. That's what I was looking to see, if there was a difference in color for clicking on them. I hadn't, didn't know if I'd listened to these yet, but there is. This UX could do with a little bit of uh, touching up. Just like having the contrast dialed up more between the you've already seen this and you haven't yet. Because those colors are almost identical. I'm doing... So is darling your uh, I'll answer in a moment. If you Sorry, Lily. If insist on clinging <clears throat> to such outdated hierarchies, then... Yes. However, I would argue that our fields are too dissimilar for one to manage the other. Of course, darling would much prefer to find his own miracle solution to the Bureau's fungal frustrations. He always needs to be the hero. 
uh, you asked, if I'm the director, why am I doing everyone's stuff? So it seems like only the director can bind to OOPs the way that I do. Um, so I have the unique ability of being able to quiet or contain these items. Yeah. Yeah, chaos. So tell me again how you came to work at the Bureau. Well, like I said, I was brought in as a special advisor. A temporary position, you see. Although that's not the whole truth. I was employed here for a time, straight out of university. After a decade of admittedly fascinating work in threshold research and regulation, I began to chafe under the bureaucracy. I needed a change. Not that academia was so different. And then the mold happened. About four months ago, yes. Since my departure from the Bureau, they hadn't been able to find my equal in threshold analysis. Darling and I had kept in touch over the years, meeting at conferences and the like. He called me, and I booked a flight. I've never been able to say no to a man with a dangerous alien biosphere. <laughs> I had to leave my post in the middle of term, but so be it. So she's a professor. That explains a lot. So I'm special, special. I mean, that gun is literally Excalibur. So yeah. About as special as a motherfucker gets. And yeah, under normal operating procedure, there are other uh, para, uh, para, uti para utilitarians, individuals who combine to OOPs or are bound to an OOP and therefore have enhanced abilities or powers and stuff, kind of like what the OOPs are giving me. Um, but they're in short supply and or can't do what I do right now. So... Para-utilitarians is a hard word. Indeed. Even people are susceptible. The fungus grows rapidly within the chest cavity, killing the host. Luckily, one must ingest the stalks to become infected. Don't eat the mold. Okay. We've always cremated the infected bodies after autopsy, but I believe there may be another stage of maturity. A blooming, if you will. I never thought the word blooming would sound so horrible. Yeah, we were deemed special. She got away, and Dylan did not. Thanks for the information. <clears throat> My pleasure. Oh, I'm feeling a bit hungry. You hungry, Steve? It's not funny. Go help Fridge Guy. Travel to Containment Panopticon. Thank you. 
fridge guy. Here I come. You bought the game? Hell yeah. I feel like I've expanded your game library so much, Lily. <laughs> uh, fourth floor, okay. That's not good. Uh, there we go. Let's try that again. Cool. The Alan Wake ones? That's awesome. I think you're Gary, dude. <laughs> she meant to write gray. Then you know it. Hell yeah, the Foundation series is amazing. the other direction. Panopticon. There's someone named Philip up in a cell. He's watching the refrigerator and very rapidly losing it. Philip. Oh shit, I forgot about fridge duty. He's been in there for over a day, I totally forgot. You forgot about him? There's well, I mean, hit, the hiss on. happened. The hiss? The Benikoff TV? Considering the number of things I'm juggling, <clears throat> ma'am, I think it's... Listen, it's fine. We just need to get him out of there. He said you'd be able to open the cell door? Yeah, I can unlock it on my terminal. 
There. Done. Door. Open. But Philip can't just leave. The fridge is behaving erratically. Ocular contact is the only thing that seems to placate it. If we don't have someone in there watching it 24-7, people will die. I'll figure something out. I'm pretty good with these things. Being pretty good with altered items isn't standard bureau procedure. <laughs> he doesn't know us very well. <laughs> I'll see you later, Langston. I'll be here. <laughs> isn't standard bureau procedure. See, that, I mean, that answers part of that question earlier, Lily. See, that's not how it's supposed to work. It's just what I'm doing. I saw that death coming. I had no energy. I had nothing I could do. <laughs> I, sh I should use the shield right there. <clears throat> Almost had it.
Oh, it clawed through the... Okay. Okay. I wasn't even looking at the ground. Security cameras aren't working. How do I? How'd it go? Where's Philip? Philip's gone. Something happened before I could get him out. Poor Philip. He never did like fridge duty. But if you're here, then who's watching the fridge? The fridge is fine now. I took care of it. You don't just take care of altered items. What did you do? I touched it, and wound up in the astral plane. This... thing was in there. It was huge, had one big eye. Wasn't friendly. We've been getting reports from the astronauts lately about something fitting that description. The astral plane is usually connected to our world through objects of power, not altered items. If this thing is linking itself to altered items, then it's clearly powerful. This may happen again. Do you think that thing is what got Philip? Must have been. The Panopticon is a dangerous place. The agents all know the risks. But, since you're some sort of altered item whisperer, I've got a list of others for you to corral. The hiss are causing containment breaches left, right, and center. Here, start with these. I'll see if there are any others missing while you're gone. My life just got a whole lot easier. Wow. <clears throat> I'll see you later, Langston. I'll be here. So I've just got a bunch of busy work now between all my missions. Yeah, list. All right, we're going to go put a record on. Can we smack him? He seems like an entitled prick. No, I like Langston. <laughs> oh, so good. Oh, yep. It's them eating the fungus. All right. How about this? Mm-hmm. 
What the fuck? Why did that read like a a blackmail notice? <clears throat> Here we go. <laughs> My facial reactions reading the subtitles. Yeah. I mean, it was some bullshit, dude. <clears throat> Dude is the scariest motherfucker I have oh, ever shit. laid Whoops. eyes on. Like I said, though, no offense. Okay. I have to go. Me too. You're not the only one who's busy, you know. They're in danger of us by bringing this in. If Trench was still around, he'd have stopped this. Please. Trench was part of the same shadowy group. Where's the jukebox? Box. Found you on accident, bud. Oh. Well, this makes sense as to the tokens. It's repeatable content. random debuffs.
This is a really cool level.
Damn, dude. <clears throat> I don't know what I was doing wrong. That was lasting forever. Did it bug? Because the other two were pretty quick. I didn't realize I had to stand on the plate. I just did that on accident for the other two. I thought it was based off of killing things around. I understand now. My bad. I'm doing so much easier. It should have been obvious, honestly.
Squad Captain Lopez, reporting on Expedition 17B. At the formation now, visually no distinction from the previous visit. The link detectors are still standing. One arch has a light flashing, so we're going to give the area once over. Then we'll head back. Lopez out. Retrieve the lost specimen data. Do I have to restart the whole thing again? If so, I'm going to do a different island first. Nope, okay. It did take away time, though. Getting health. Oh my god. <sighs> More time gone. I'm th so this is a slow motion failure because there's no way I can do the other ones in this amount of time. How do I reset? This is rough. Adding a time component to it is also a dick move.
Okay. Oh, they heal. They hella heal. that yeah yeah sure enough the camera does hide the quest UI oh no how do I get up there That was it. Is it a mission still? Yeah, it's still a mission. Okay. We'll pick that back up in a moment. <clears throat> 